In this short reminder, I want to share with you something from ayah number 67 of Surah Al-Baqarah in which Allah Azza wa Jal talks about the incident of the cow. Of course, Surah Al-Baqarah is called the cow. When Musa alayhi salam said to his nation, no doubt it is Allah that in fact commands you that you should slaughter a cow. Their first response was, atattakhiduna huzwa. That's what the ayah says. Do you take us for a joke? Are you kidding us? You want us to slaughter a cow? A murder just happened. And God's response is that we should slaughter a cow? This sounds kind of ridiculous. And I'm sharing this as my first reminder because Allah made it a point to mention what their reaction was to Allah's instructions. A prophet is telling you on Allah's behalf, slaughter a cow. Whether that makes logical sense to you or not, it's God's command and it's validated because it's coming through His Messenger. But your response is, are you kidding? Are you taking us as a joke? And you know what? This is mentioned because this is a timeless problem. So to this day you're going to have people that hear of Muslims, who will hear of an instruction that is clearly from Allah's Messenger they're going to say, what are you kidding me? Are you serious? And that's going to be their reaction. You know, you can't be serious. That's what Islam wants, that's what the Sharia says, that's what the Hadith says, that's what the Ayah says. No way, that doesn't make any sense, etc, etc. This kind of reaction. And this kind of reaction would make Musa السلام, extremely upset. So within the same Ayah, قَالَ أَعُوذُ بِاللَّهِ he said, I seek Allah's refuge. From what? An akuna min al jahilin. That I should be from those who lose their emotional control. Jahil actually is the opposite of aqil. Aqil is someone who controls their emotions. Jahil is someone who loses them. In this final minute, I want to remind you that this ayah isn't just a warning to those who make a mockery out of Allah's commandments. On the other hand, it's also a warning to those who deliver Allah's message, who try to do the work of the prophets who when they say something on behalf of Allah and it's mocked and it's ridiculed, that they should not lose their cool. Because Musa immediately says, I seek refuge of Allah, that I should be from those who are jahil, who lose their cool. In other words, this would really enrage him and he, doesn't, he does not want to lose his temper because then he will not be able to do his job. So, you know, carrying the message of Islam and giving advice for the sake of Allah requires a thick skin and you're going to have to deal with some very obnoxious people who will say some really ridiculous things and you're going to have to say أعوذ بالله أن أكون من الجاهلين May Allah make us of those who one, never make fun of Allah's commandments and two, when they do give advice to each other and they hear things that are inappropriate in response are able to control their emotions and control their temper. Barakallahu li wa lakum, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.